Welcome to the Pageant Cast, your home for beauty pageant news and interviews on the internet. This is the Pageant Cast. I'm Tim Kretschmann, and I am standing next to this vision from Arkansas. We have Renee. You are competing as Mrs. Arkansas International. How fun! How I know. Exciting. I'm so excited to be here. It's a lot of fun. Okay, so first I need to ask you questions that relate to. I need secrets about your director so I can use them in future. No, uh, what I want to ask you about is your platform, of course, yes. as being the international pageant. So, what is your platform? I have a nonprofit back in the state of Arkansas. It's called Voices Against Violence, okay. and it's a national program that I'm really excited about working with. Voices Against Violence is it street violence, is it domestic abuse? It is what domestic it? violence. Domestic abuse. Yes. Okay. So, uh, what do you do about that? A lot of times it's family. I know from the police people that I know, they don't like going into those types of calls because they're very dangerous. What do you do? What is, how do you fit it? The, the best thing we can do is educate our communities on domestic violence, mm -hmm. what to look for, and if this is happening to them, how to react to it, and how to get out of that situation. So what do so you look for? education is key. You look for signs, and it can be he or she. So many people think domestic violence just happens to women. That's mm -hmm. incorrect. It happens okay. also to men as well. Okay. So. What, what is a sign? I mean, bruising? Uh, yes, of course, the signs for? are definitely bruising for sure. That's mm -hmm. a big one. But more importantly, it's fear. If you see fear in someone's eyes and they're acting timid and they're acting afraid of something, you know something is not right. Something's not right. No, okay. not at all. All right. And you might so, need to go talk to that person. Yeah, what do you do? If you suspect something, you may not want to interject yourself because, like right. I say, it's a dangerous situation. Exactly. What you kind of have to feel the situation, warm up mm -hmm. to that person. If they feel in need of you know, you being able to walk up to them and talk to them, talk to them. If you feel that it's an opportunity to, for you to save someone's life, I mean, why wouldn't you take that chance? So mm -hmm. it's kind of like, don't let it pass you by. Okay. So uh, tell me about getting involved in pageants. Uh, have you done pageants long? Is this a first? <laughs> I have no idea. No, that's okay. I've actually been in pageants all my life. I've won okay. my first national talent competition at the age of three. And so it's been something that I've it's enjoyed all my life. <laughs> wow. So you've been doing this a long time. Any pageants of note? I like to use pageants. Past titles that... Uh, yeah, I was... Yeah. Actually, in 2004, I was Miss Arkansas International. In 2005, I was also Miss Southern States International. So I love the international pageant and what okay. it exceeds and what um, it represents. Okay. And now now you're here? That's right. I'm Mrs. here as a missus. Okay. Who's the lucky guy? The lucky guy is my husband. His name is J.D. Stone. Well, I knew it would be your husband. <laughs> I, I'm dense. I'm not completely <laughs> off my rock. Yeah, okay. And uh, what did he do? How did he woo you? Oh, man. Well, believe it or not, we met in high school, but okay. uh, he's such a wonderful person, and he makes me want to be a better person every day, and he just woos me over every day of being the person that he is that I fell in love with. So you're well wooed. Yes, I'm yeah. well wooed by him. Uh, all right, fantastic. <laughs> now, how did you guys come out here? Did you drive? Did you fly? I drove up with my director, Brene Thoreau, okay. and uh, it was a long drive, but it was definitely well worth it. Okay, and I noticed there was a gun on you that you would make sure that her name got into the video. No, she's... <laughs> she's a great director. She is. She's a lot of fun. That's well, right. That's fantastic. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to come well, by. Well, yes, thank and, you so uh, much. Wish you the best of luck and success. Thank you. Greatly appreciate it. <laughs> We're here with Carrie. She's Mrs. Nevada International. This is Pageant Cast TV. Thanks so much for dropping by. Thank you for having me. Well, you just came out of interviews. How were interviews? It was so fun. It was fun. It was fun. It was they were fun. So it was, uh, sweet. Where was the word nerve wracking in ne there? Not a bit. Not a bit. Absolutely not a bit. They were so warm and gracious and. Not oh, we need new judges. What's going on? It was no. awesome. <laughs> well, I want to go back great. in. That's great. They don't let you take another lap. I know. 
that's too bad. Out. Yeah, I think it's for the judge's safety. Yeah, it, it, that becomes a long day. I admire them. I'm sure it's already been a long day. Yeah. So well, that's great. Yeah. Well, uh, so much fun. Now, a big part of international is, of course, the platform. Yes. So tell me about your platform. My platform is the American Cancer Society's Relay for Life, and actually, Relay found me. I didn't. They find found me. you. Yes. Okay. Um, sadly, there's been a lot of cancer in my family, and okay. I've been a caregiver for friends, and I never felt like I was doing enough. <laughs> So one summer I was back here, I'm actually from the area, I was visiting friends mm -hmm. and one of my friends told me at night that she was starting chemotherapy the next day. And a few weeks later when I went back to work, I work in a high school, the administration said, oh, we're thinking about doing this Relay for Life, what do you think? Mm -hmm. I mean, you and talk about a sign for yeah, God, it was just exactly where I was supposed to there. be. Mm -hmm. Wow, that, yeah. that is really neat. Um, have you had a lot of appearances this year? I have. I've gotten to do some radio interviews, some TV interviews, all about the American Cancer Society. Uh, there's been children's charities, which are always very bittersweet because I love the children, but it's so hard knowing how sick they are. Now That's you're, the hardest part. You're out in Vegas, mm -hmm. right? Um, is the construction boom still going on? No, or no, it's, it's slowed down, down quite yeah. a bit, right? Right. And the area where I teach and where we held Relay is in one of the highest foreclosure zip codes in the country. Oh, wow. And yet we wow. still managed to raise $75,000 in two years. Fantastic. So, yeah, we're pretty proud Now, you of didn't raise that by going down to Caesars or something and go, no, hey, put it on no, red. No, no, no okay. gambling involved. Um, okay. <laughs> it was just a lot of hard work and some really amazing volunteers. That is fantastic. So I, I have to ask you, Las Vegas, what is it like living there? The place never seems to close down. You know, we only go near the Strip and all those Vegas things mm -hmm. when we have people in town that want to go there. Right. Okay. Um, so the, it's a normal city oh, outside absolutely. the block or whatever. Absolutely. And my friend who was going through chemo, her children just came and stayed with us for a week. And we took them to a baseball game and the lake and the dam, the mountains. There's so much to do out there. We oh. We're far hours from the beach. We could go skiing the opposite direction. We have everything. I, my favorite is when people say, I went to Las Vegas, but I don't really gamble, so there's nothing to do. And I'm like, oh, there's so much to do. Where did you go? There's so much to what? do. What? Yeah. yeah, there's plenty to do. Yeah. Uh, yes, gambling is the focus. Yeah, there's yeah, no that's question true, about but that. But there is an there's, alternative. There Lots is of alternatives. Absolutely. Well, that's great. Yeah. Well, I uh, wish you the best of Thank luck and success. Much. It's going to be a great program the next few days. I think so, yeah. You're going to have a lot of fun. <laughs> and I saw you practicing the walk out oh, already. Got the walk going she, on. She's got that all <laughs> set up. So that's going to be fantastic. Uh, thanks so much. Thank and thanks you for so coming much. to Patch and Cast TV. Take care. TV.